right. Tom probably just explained it. Yeah. Do you understand? Uh, how it turns on. Yeah, I think so. It's just the angle between. I was just wondering about the angle between the tail and the. Um, because that was the confusing bit when we were trying to weld, wasn't it? Yeah. But. So this idea of it being <laughs> offset from the tower, everyone's got that. that it, would con it constantly wants to be turned on itself. Because the centre of rotation of this is all offset. So rather than blades, just think of there just being a big square board here. You always want to turn like that. But if I'm the whip, it would always be flowing around like that because you've got momentum. But as soon as you expose... As soon as you turn around there, more of the tail gets exposed and pushes it back. Mm -hmm. And you put that out on a strange angle, so that, that happens, and this is actually facing the wall. So you get a balance. Yeah, because you've got a balance. I noticed that was just the last time around as well. Yeah. <laughs> oh, what, because it's quite messy welding? Yeah, it was a bit hard. Yeah, we didn't get it quite right. It's interesting because at the moment the anchors there aren't coming in as quick. No, just the most difficult bit. How much force do I need to exert on this to furl it then? Well, we've seen this give out 700 watts before it furls, which is probably going to have been a. 15 metre a second wind, something like that. Yeah, that's quite fast. <laughs> um, yeah, so essentially it's because the tail of this thermite is so heavy. Like that's yeah. a really big fat bit of plywood in your waist. It's going to make the tail smaller. It's way less than it for all these uh, wind speeds. Yeah. So it's that. Rather than, yeah, it's that mechanism. <laughs> Rather than it just folding up, it would sort of pop it like that and bounce up and down a bit and pop it like that. And it it's a great way to do it. You do that by the weight of the tail. If it's quite a turbulent spot, then it does tend to sort of curl and then crash. Yeah. 